Hey Brat fans, it's Indy here, and we thought before the decade is over, we should probably take a look at some of Brat's biggest moments from 2019. So let's get into it. Number 19, the infamous blue bird. You came. Of course I did. I, I wanted to see you. I, I won you something. Mom's favorite. I love it. <laughs> Go with me here. I'm actually starting to believe that Junior is the real star of Brad. Like, like, let that idea stew for a minute. Number 18. Autumn breaks the news to Brody. What's up, guys? Oh, perfect. What? What's up is, what's your problem, Autumn? My problem? Look. You can't be bothered to actually hang out with Zoe since you've got this new girlfriend, and then the second that she finds a new guy, you give her attitude about it? Look, I know it used to be you two against the world, but you've made it perfectly clear that she's replaceable. And guess what? So are you. Number 17, Sam flips out. Sam. You stole my song. Your song? I've been working on it for weeks. All you need is come up with a melody. The melody is the entire song. I did most of the work, and you don't want me hanging with your family anyway, okay? Just best to part ways. Number 16. I stole the money. How you get through these experiences will inform the person you become for the rest of your life. Ellie, may I speak to you in the hall? I'd like you to move out of my house. Oh, emotional. Number 15. Yeah, you can take me there. Number 14, Nelly versus Josh. Do you want coffee? Yeah, sounds great. You do not want to see me eat chocolate. It's like poison ivy, except with more crying. Are you okay? Is there chocolate in this drink? The label just said coffee. Josh, Josh, Josh. Wait, so how does the saying go? An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Crown Lake kids are very into revenge. Number 13, Rhyme meets Wes. Look, I don't know about you, but I'm a firm believer in love at first sight. Number 12. Nelly and Tiffany become BFFs. Roll your hand up on the handle, and then with speed, crack the ball. I knew you'd be good at this. Snap your wrist sideways when you throw. This. What the heck? You'll get better. Can we call this a truce? Yeah. Number 11. I want you to have this. Oh God, Ty, are you proposing? Because we're still kids. Oh, no, 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 definitely not, no. Um, it's, it's a promise ring, okay? I, I promise that you will be the only girl in my life. Woman. <laughs> um, you mean everything to me. And I love you, Luna. Do you forgive me? Number 10, Joe's dream date. I know we're technically underground, but that's no reason not to look up at the night sky. This is really beautiful. Not as beautiful as you are. 
Number nine, Isaac's big news. Elliot, you know the flower guy? He's not the flower guy. I mean, he's delivering flowers. But the flowers are from Elliot. We met this summer. He's, uh, my boyfriend. That literally made me cry. Like, sob. Tears. Number eight. He was supposed to be here today, and now he's not coming, and this is supposed to be the best day ever. Well, it still can be. So, where is Mr. Perfect? He's sick. Sick? With what? He has the flu. Axel? He has the flu. The, the flu? flu? Yeah, so what? It's going around. You wouldn't happen to have a picture of this boyfriend, would you? Yeah, he's my phone background. O. M. G. Axel? Number seven. Goth boy and goth girl fall in love. No! We have to wait on Desiree. It's locked out a thousand times too short for us to bore ourselves. I love Nietzsche. There's nothing like watching two devil worshippers fall in love. <laughs> it's beautiful and terrifying. Um, yes, top 10 tween romance of all time. Mark it down. Number six, fashion show. Introducing our new summer collection. Number five, the Stoony reunion. What happened? Mel knocked into me this morning and I dropped it. I'm really sorry. She's upset. It doesn't give her the right. She's upset that I broke up with her. Oh, you did? That, my friends, was really a kiss heard around the world. Number four, who is Heather? We all contributed. It's just how it is. Everyone gets a Heather book when they first come. It's a rite of passage. Tiffany did it to me, and you'll have to do it to the next new girl. But you got through it. It's over. Guys, we're at number three. Cassie. I knew you'd come back. We're on in two hours. Came back to get you. What, what do you mean? We're going to California. We can finally do what we talked about. Me on guitar, you dancing. Sam, you're, you're being crazy. It's just two weeks, and then you can decide. Come with me. I need you. It's number two. She thought that we wouldn't work because I have feelings for someone else. I think she's right. See, I know this girl. She's super sweet and funny and pretty. She's nicer than anyone deserves. She loves her friends and family and magic. And I think I have feelings for her. I mean, look at us. Bananas and peanut butter. That's weird. But delicious. So, what do you think? You guys were here, the top moment of 2019. This is number one. Mom, is that you? You wouldn't believe how crazy the game. Baby 
bro. Aren't you happy to see me? Of course. Yeah. Scream you hate me, I'm too inviting with I just didn't know you were coming home for the holidays. I'm not just here for the holidays. I'm here for good. Wow, so much has happened this year. I haven't even had time to take it all in yet. Anyway, on that note, I'm gonna say goodbye for now and we'll see you right back here in 2020. I'm Indiana, Happy New Year!